Hey, what's up, my lovely ladies and gentlemen, and whoever else watched this, even though you can only be a lady or a gentleman. <laughs> I am coming to you today with an unboxing. Yes, I just went to my P.O. box today, and I had a package in the mail, even though I knew it was coming. So, But this unboxing is Nature Box. Yes, and y'all forgive my lighting because I am so working on that. Every time I film, it's like I don't have good lighting. I usually film in my bathroom because that's where like the most natural light come in at in my house. But yeah, anywho, let's get this um unboxing started, shall we? I went a little overboard this month, y'all, because I just couldn't choose five snacks. And if anybody wants to know what Nature Box is, I'm pretty sure you've seen a dozen unboxings on YouTube. But I don't want to be repetitive. But anywho, it's just a subscription for $19.95. That's the smallest subscription. And you get five snacks a month. You can choose from three different packages. It's five, ten, and twenty. But of course, I got five because it's just me. So, anywho, let's get into the unboxing. Hey, y'all, I just... Okay, it comes telling me everything I got. And like I said, I couldn't just choose one, y'all. I got eight, I believe. Yep. I got eight. See, y'all, I couldn't just choose one. And y'all, this lighting suck. I am like trying to get it to where some okay lighting. But anywho. And it comes with the little pamphlet. Talking about Nature Box and how you know their promise and how you do your pantry or whatever. How you put the snacks in your pantry for the next time you order snacks, basically. So, oh, they gave me some free stuff. So, one of my eight things was like five of these mocha almond bars. And since I got one in my hand, I can just try this and see what it tastes like. Because, y'all, I am hungry. I am fresh off work. Well, not fresh. I had to go to my P.O. box. So, let me stop lying. But this is the mocha almond bar. It tastes pretty good. It tastes like peanuts and chocolate. <laughs> it tastes pretty good. Yes, it tastes divine. Okay. Now, the next thing I got is the Flex, Flex, Flex Fortune Coins. That didn't go well. I tried to tear it open and only a little piece went to tear it open. And y'all, I love the reu um, resellable thingies. This is how much they give you on the instead. Let's see if it tastes like fortune cookies. That's what one look like. It tastes like fortune cookies. It does. I like these. Might be hard to rate them, y'all. This time, if I'm smacking y'all, forgive me. Okay, the next thing, excuse me if I'm out of frame. Well, I told y'all I got a lot of stuff. This was one of my add-ons. I wanted to try it. It was the whole wheat raspberry figgy bars. I wanted to try one of those. You know what? And it's crazy. I am not a big fan of Fig Newtons. So I don't know why I was so tempted to try these. But nonetheless, let's get to trying, shall we? And they are individually wrapped. 
I always smell my food, y'all. Oh, is that weird? Probably is. I always smell my food. Hopefully these don't taste like fig newtons. I don't know what I'm expecting, but... Oh my God. I'm sorry if I'm smacking. It tastes like raspberry. I can get with this. You can taste a hint of the fig. But I can do this. It tastes like raspberry. And you get not many in the pack. Like four or five of them. But those is pretty good. You don't see why people rave about those. Okay. This next one I got because I thought they looked cute. Hopefully they taste the way they look. But it's the mini Belgian waffles. I be getting stuff because it's limited to the edition. Are y'all addicted to limited edition stuff? I know because it's just... Oh. Like, only a limited supply. Let me get some, you know. <laughs> but, this is what it looks like. Looks like a little Belgian waffle. This is how much you get in the pack, since these not individually wrapped. So, let me taste this. Let me see what it tastes like. Okay. It just tastes like a, a regular. You know like them cones that you get? That's what it tastes like. A waffle cone. That's exactly what it tastes like. Because I'm looking for some ice cream taste right now. Y'all know what? I for those um mini Belgian waffles, I don't know why. I just knew I was gonna get like a maple syrup taste since you usually put syrup on waffles. I don't know. Nature box. Y'all should upgrade that. Okay, these next ones. Oh my god, y'all. Okay, I got high expectation for this. This is the guacamole bites. And y'all, I am in love with Chipotle guacamole. So I'm not really expecting these to taste like Chipotle guacamole, but I do expect them to taste like guacamole. I saw these on the site. I'm like, oh, got to put this in the cart. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry, I'm always smelling something. But this is what it looks like in the package. They give you a lot. So I'm going to taste these. Wow. A lot of flavor. They actually taste like guacamole. Not Chipotle guacamole. But guacamole. These are good. The seasoning tastes like it's over like a corn chip. So, you know, you usually eat guacamole with tortilla chips. So, it's pretty good. Oh, that's what one look like. Guacamole bite. Man, that's going to be a midnight snack. So, so far, so good, y'all. I haven't picked up nothing that I didn't like. So far, so good. Hunty. Okay, one of these things I got in my last box. And it's the salt and um, pepper pistachios. So, there's no need for me to try them in this box because I tried them in my last unboxing. So, I like them that much. I got them again. I love pistachios. So, I'm not going to even try those. That'll be a waste of our time. But this next one, I didn't know which one to get. The strawberry or the mango. So, this time I went with the mango. So, next time I'm going to get the strawberry because I always get strawberry everything. Like, literally, I just um, left IHOP and I got the strawberry. Um, They got these new... Um, French toast things but I got the strawberry one because I always get strawberry everything so I got these mango orange fruit juice 
And I love gummy worms and gummy bears. So I'm like, let me try fruit juice and see what it looks like. Oh, that's cute. Look, it's individually packaged too. And a little cute <laughs> nature box packaging. This is this is cute. Y'all better go ahead with this packaging. Just sunshiny. Make you think of spring. This is, I don't know if y'all can see in there. I don't want it to come out. But that was probably a attempt to fail since my lighting is terrible. But this is what one looked like. A little gummy fruit tree. I'm trying to get in some good lighting, y'all. But I'm finna have to taste this one. I taste more mango than I do orange. There's the orange. Kids will go wild for these. Look, I haven't stopped eating. I know the strawberry ones are fine. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna put them there. Damn. Okay. Gonna eat them all up at once. Last but not least. Okay, it's nothing sweet, y'all. I got a real bad sweet tooth. So that's why a lot of my snacks is sweet. But these last one is the crunchy, I mean country. Uh, LD. <laughs> the country ranch sunflower kernels. Basically, this is Nature Box rendition of sunflower seeds. Let's just open it up, shall we? And it smells like sunflower seeds. This is how much they give you in the package. I don't want to spill it. And since I love ranch flavor, everything. Let me just taste some of these. Sunflower seeds. You know, back in the day when you was a kid, you used to eat sunflower seeds and spit the holes. Well, the shell in the cup, like, ah. Uh. I'm so glad they start um, de-shelling the sunflower seeds because that was just gross. You see a whole bunch of, like, little seeds all on the porch or on the ground. Like, somebody been eating sunflower seeds. <laughs> but, yep, rank sunflower seeds. What, as Nature Box would say, kernels. But that is... Ow, for my nature box unboxing. I wish I had a country accent. Did that country accent sound okay? Probably didn't. So if I had to rank these, uh, it'll be hard, y'all, because I liked everything in this one. My number one ranking, it wouldn't be fair if I put the pistachios in there since I did get it extra. So I'm not going to even rank this in there. Because clearly I like those. I got them again. Yep. Clearly I like those. Because I repurchased them. Sure did. Um, I think the guacamole bites. Would probably be number one. Because they are really flavorful. Um, Number two. Would probably be. The flax fortune coins. Because they was really good. And I love um, fortune cookies. I like eat Chinese food just to get the fortune cookies and the um, egg rolls. Don't tell nobody that, y'all. And surprisingly, I think I'm going to go with the um, raspberry figgy bars for number three. And I don't even like fig newtons. But these was bomb because all I taste was raspberry. Hello, somebody. Talking about some of your come up genism. Yes. And then I think I'll put the sunflower kernels seeds in fourth place. Fifth place, I will put the mango um, ch um chewy thingies, mango juice. And sixth place, the Belgian waffles, y'all, because it was disappointing. Yeah, I was looking for, maybe I can eat some ice cream and put it in the ice cream or something. 
But I don't know why I was looking for that maple syrup taste for some apparent reason. But nonetheless, it was good. If I had to rank something, that will be its ranking. So somebody got to go last. I mean, yeah, last can be good. Yeah, anywho. <laughs> That's all for my Nature Box unboxing. I love my snacks. I am going to be snacking for a while. Um, And this is my maze. Um unboxing so i'm happy with what i picked i can't wait till next month so i can pick another five maybe six <laughs> you know yeah snacks and all but yeah and the add-ons is just three dollars one of them i got for free these um these right here they gave them to me for free they gave me five of them actually i think they're dollars i had it upside down i think they're a dollar to add on but individually but they gave me five of them for free so thank you nature box but anywho i hope you all have a blessed day i'm sure gonna have a blessed day and i love you all thanks for watching and excuse the lighting once again y'all i'm sorry but i love y'all thank you bye bye